Pikmin Planters, Professor Chaz here, the lab coat's on back order, and we're here continuing our adventure in Pikmin. It is currently day 12, it is currently episode number 10. If you're excited for today's continuing adventure in the Forest Naval, that's right, the belly button of the forest, hit that like button down below and show your support for the series, and your encouragement for me not to mess up quite as bad as I did yesterday. No real big spoilers, but Pikmin were lost. Hopefully that will not happen today, because we're just going to jump right back in, heading back down to the Forest Naval. There are, well, there's actually one ship part we were bringing closer to us by the time the day ended yesterday. So we should get that back in little to no problem. And there's going to be uh, two in the water, which I don't think are going to be too hard for us to grab. I don't think there's any enemies in the way. And here's the Pikmin that were grown from the puff stool we dealt with yesterday. We're going to start off by grabbing 30 red Pikmin and grab the, what is it, the Omega Stabilizer, which was the part that we had to leave partway, not at base. Okay, let's head on over. I was talking about how the holidays were going for everybody, and I was way sidetracked. Because uh, when you're losing Pikmin left and right, it's kind of your focus to not let that continue. Where is the Omega Stabilizer? Right down here. And I think all the creatures have been dealt with. Everything should be done and out of the way. So they got that. I'm going to trust them to be able to bring that back safely. And by trust them, I mean trust me to have cleared the way for them. And we're going to grab some blue Pikmin. Because we got to try to do a little bit of underwater exploration. Well, not really... I guess technically we'd be underwater, at least uh, above our head, which means red and yellow Pikmin can't follow where we want to go. And there's a couple sh uh, ship pieces over here. Ship parts, I keep not saying it. Okay, that, uh, what am I thinking? Actually, this one is going to be a little tricky to get because I'll show you why. Actually, yeah, hang on, that might be the second piece we get today. And it'll open a path to the third one as well. Uh, so it's down here, I believe. We've got... I think there's one of his ion engines, if I'm not mistaken. I found my number one ionium jet! I was close. Unfortunately, this puts out a slightly odiferous exhaust. It means it stinks. But it does propel me to escape velocity in an instant. The stench is a small price to pay for such performance. Okay, how many do you need to carry that? Can all 30 of you grab that? Is it only just 25? That's fine and dandy. Let's grab the rest of you guys. So I don't know what the purpose of this is. I think it's like... <gasps> That's the purpose! The bomb rocks! Alright, we found some. Uh, you guys can start building this. I believe... Actually, what is the purpose of this? I can bring the yellow Pikmin down, throw them to get them up, and then just walk into them to collect them. So yes, that's... Basically, I just got sidetracked. That's our next priority. We're going to grab some bomb rocks and open up some paths here. He's excited. I's excited. How do I even walk up here? I mean, I could have easily followed them, but I thought there was a shortcut. Oh, look at this. Look at this beauty. Right at the start of the day. Two ship pieces on their way. How do you like that? I like it. Oh, look at them. Look at this. Oh, it's so cool. And you can see the blues right behind them. Oh, we're making some strides now. All right. Calm down, Professor. We still have a long way to go. Omega Stabilizer. This is the dolphin's fin. It is a little beaten up, but it should still function. I've made great strides in repairing the dolphin. With this, I should be able to fly again, even if I don't recover all 30 parts. Now, that's written in yellow. That's important to note. Now, I recovered 13 of 30. We just need 16 more parts to increase our range. And there's one of them right there. The number one Ionium Jet. So, I think... What I should do... I don't know. I'm trying to think. I, okay, so the other part I was talking about, I do know we need to use reds and blues to get. But will I have time while they're doing that to blow up some walls? I don't know. Number one Ionium Jet. If this is damaged, I'll be in dire straits. He's just saying he's all heightened up like, Oh, I can make it! Well, if this is busted, forget all that. I'll be in dire straits. I'll have to run a system check as soon as I can. 14 of 30 parts. Okay. I think the best course of action, I'm going to let these guys sit back in the onion for now so I can bring out a bunch of yellows and start bombing some of these walls. Because that's going to speed up overall our maneuverability here in the forest naval. Uh, all that fun stuff. I'm going to go with, let's start with 12 yellows, I think. 
I'm gonna be careful how I do this though, because I gotta get them down. So I'm wondering what's the point of that stick though. Oh, uh, where do we go? It's way back behind us. Okay. Um, yeah, like the sticks that they built. Do we even need that? Because like, I'm gonna be throwing the yellows back up. Sounds like they won't agree with my my uh, stomach, but that's not what I mean at all. Huh. So I have to get them. Oh, I see. Hang on. I'm pretty sure I can throw them over the, the little ridges. So I'm gonna go up top of you like this. So if I bring them down here and throw them across here, if that works. It does, yes, okay. So I'll throw them over there. And I gotta come all the way back up here myself. Yeah, because I'm curious why they would give me the sticks for them to uh, climb up. Because Unless they can climb up with their bombs, but I doubt it. Or did I? Hang on. No, I gotta get them over there. Okay, so I messed up. Oh, boy. I'm glad I got two pieces back already, because I'm going to be wasting so much time otherwise here. Okay, if you guys can make it over there, that'd be great. Don't slip into the water if you can help it. Okay. That's what I like about, like... Quick, uh, good question for you folks in the comments. What is your favorite kind of game? And what would you categorize this as? Because this, you know, feels like adventure, but it's... I see it as a puzzle game. So, like, how do I... I can just walk down this ledge here. Okay. Okay, okay. So, let's grab you yellows. Get these away from the water. I'm just going to walk down this ledge here. And then I can walk down this ledge here. Okay, so they're over here now with me, and they can grab these bomb rocks. Grab as many as you can, boys. We've got some walls to break open. I'm not sure how many there even are in total to pick up here. I wonder if there's any more. Now, can you guys climb with those? You can? Oh, sweet. I didn't know that. Uh, dude. Yo, dude. Or dudes, I should say. Can you guys go up? Can you go up? Thank you. Who would have thought they could climb with the bomb rocks? I mean, I could have probably done what I was thinking, too. My thought was, so, if you missed previous episodes, throw, or, uh, dismissing a yellow Pikmin holding a bomb rock is fine. You can whistle them back into your group, and then, you know, no problem there. But, uh, if you throw a yellow Pikmin with bomb rock, then they will throw their rock, or they'll drop it, and it'll blow up. And you don't want that. You need to take them to, uh, somewhere to get, you know, the bomb rocks made use of. So I'm going to have to throw them up this ledge. There's nothing for them to, to blow up here, so they're going to hold on to them. If I were to go up and whistle, that's when they would drop them. But if I just walk into them like I did moments ago, they will rejoin the group and maintain those bomb rocks. And you, I can whistle your blue. All right, now let's start get up. Tripping everywhere. Okay. No! Come with me. I knew someone was going to try and go after that rock. There's nectar inside that rock, if you don't know. Uh, we're going to put the blues away. Make sure that they're out of the blast radius. I should grab these reds right now while they're uh, fully bloomed. Get more flower pickling on our side. And try to make use of all these bomb rocks we can. Now, I'm pretty sure there's another spot I can get more bomb rocks. This is not the only 12 they give us for this place. But I think this should take care of this gray wall here. And I think there was a black one nearby as well. It takes three bomb rocks for the gray ones. And I think uh, the, the, uh, the black ones, the dark gray, I think they take a total of nine. Yeah, three sets of three bombs from the yellow Pikmin. And that should be all the reds to pluck out. Send them back in as well. All right, let's finally get the first wall busted open. Three of you go to it. And get out of the way. Did one of you run back with your bomb? Wait, what? Did, did you see that? Did one carry his bomb back? Oh, no, this just takes more bomb rocks. Okay. 
Now, should it take two more if I'm not necessarily mistaking my guess? That only leaves us with six more. Okay, so at least we got that open. This does open up some possibilities. So this is one that I want to see what... Okay, divide up, guys. Grab all of you. We got six bombs left to our name. We got four? Anywho, throw a couple. Now that's not enough by itself, so we need two more down here. I'm just going to wait and make sure I'm throwing them correctly. I don't want to throw a non-bomb rock down there. So it takes three per level. Alright, now fortunately I do think that if time runs out for the day, uh, these walls don't reset, so we should be okay. Until we find more bomb rocks. The next thing I'm going to do is take a squad of reds and blues to deal with a bit of an issue. I think we'll be safe with say 30 red and 30 blue probably good amount. Okay, you guys come on out. Let's grab the blues. That's why they call it the blues because there's water everywhere. And we're going to go hopefully not have to deal with any more sheer wigs. We're going to go follow this very narrow path and grab this piece. And I think there's a bridge we can start to build down here, too. All right, now, check the map again. How do I get there? <laughs> I gotta go... basically, straight ahead... or no, wait, where am I looking? No, it's behind me, so we gotta go down... basically, through the wall, I think we just blew up. All right, let's see if I know what I'm talking about. Where's the wall we just blew up? Can't even find that. There it is. So it's going to be a bit slower going to get back after this and hope the sheer wigs are still done. Hope we have the, uh, no fiery blowhogs to worry about as well here. There is one. So in that case, divvy up, guys. I don't know if we have enough time to get this all done in one day, but again, as long as we can find a ship piece, we'll get things back to our ship as fast as we can. Um, did you just throw them up on that hill? I didn't know they could go up there. Can I get up there? I wonder if that's a way to, uh... Boundary break the game. I'm not that much into, you know... Finding unintended secrets like that, so I'm gonna leave that idea behind for now. We do need a whole bunch of these Pikmin to break down this wall. Hopefully 60 will take care of that nicely. Okay, while you guys work on that, let me go see if where I think another set of bomb rocks is is correct. Let's go wade in the water. Look out. Ah, there's no problem. They're a piece of cake. So there's a bridge we'll need to build here. I somehow feel like there's bomb rocks around here. This here was where that bread bug would have taken stuff back to that we uh, dealt with on the very first day we landed here. And I felt like maybe up on that, uh, where they can build that bridge, more like a ramp, I guess I should call it. I think there was bomb rocks. There. there is a machine part up there, though. But I feel like there was bomb rocks. It's so dark. And why do we need to build another bridge here? Wait, that's why. There are bomb rocks here. Okay. So, we'll need to eventually build these bridges. No problem, no problem. I think there's another piece around here. Right here, yep. It's the antidioxin filter. This fits over the rocket's exhaust ports and filters out all disease-causing agents from the ship's exhaust. You mean we've been spreading disease-causing agents this whole time? That means I'll be able to move around without polluting the planet's atmosphere. I feel worlds better. Well, we're not grabbing it yet. So, don't count your sorries before they're stuffed in the sack, mister. Who knows that reference? We're talking ancient times in the in the in the before times in the long long ago. Hurry up, guys! We don't have a lot of time for this. But now you're seeing a bit of a problem. There's fire. Why would I bring blue Pikmin to a fire? I'll tell you why. Because the ship we're, or ship part we're going to get is in the water. Of course, only blue Pikmin can uh, pick that up. So we just got to be really careful and like just like hug the wall time ourselves accordingly, but I'm going to probably grab the reds first. Again, they don't have any problem going through fire, and they can start working on a bridge that is... I don't know if you can see it. Not really. Part way down there, though. Alright, everyone together. 
good. Split up. Okay, let's grab these red dudes. Okay, don't need to worry about getting torched. I'll still steer them away if possible. Okay, you guys start building this bridge for me, please. While I carefully lure the blues. Did... What? That was not my fault. One of these blue goofballs thought it was wise to tag along with the reds. And he got himself burnt to a crisp. Again, no one can blame me for that. Could I have looked closer to see if he was in my party? Yes. Did I? No. Therefore, you can't blame me for that. Is that how that works? I don't even know. It's a computer! I found my analog computer! Analog? That's, that's ancient technology. This computer conveys the kind of vague data that falls outside the range of ones and zeros. Actually, to be honest, it's a little bit too vague, so it isn't very helpful. Now, I think he might be making reference to the fact that um, some pieces in this, there's like five ship parts that you actually do not need to get in order to beat this game. And this might be one of them. Okay, I think that's good. As close as we need to get it. Only 27. There should be two more. Okay, you boys, uh, help them with this. I gotta see. Where are the two that are missing? Did they stay back here? Nope. Uh, do you guys see any blue dots on my map? Uh, there's a leaf. Uh, wait. Oh, they're at... Okay, they carried something back. I can see them right by their onion dot. Okay, I think that's fine. Let's see if we can get this bridge completed, or at least get as close to as possible. I believe this maintains the level of prop... What is that down there? Leaves. I don't know. Leaves me confused. But I believe they do maintain the uh, level of progress of the bridge. So I'll whistle them back. If they're not done by the time we're at like five seconds, I'll bring them back to my squad. We should be fine. I don't think there's any Pikmin standing idle anywhere. This does lead to another ship part too, though, so I do need to get this uh, bridge built eventually. You know, I'm having fun with this. It's been so like so long since I played. You know, again, it took a bit of a break over the holidays. I want to... I mean, I'm going to record the next episode right after this. I forgot how fun this is just to get stuff accomplished. Guys, you can do this. Come on. One more roll out. And then we can transform. What? Hang on. Okay. Down to the wire. Can you do it? Yes. Whistle, 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 whistle. Everybody back, please. Okay. One died. Two at the onion. We're good. Total should be 60. But things happen. <clears throat> Excuse me. But we are making progress. So now... I believe we need reds to move that other big piece back. And I need yellows to throw up high enough to get another piece that we just built the bridge to. So we're making good progress here. We're only losing a few Pikmin here and there. Today, actually, we only lost one, which is good. I was going to say, if he jumps in and squishes somebody, I'll be like, listen, man, okay, where were they hiding? I wouldn't know. <sighs> 12 days since impact. It is very strange. The scenery of this planet, which I once found hostile, now sing sometimes strikes me as surprisingly serene. Perhaps the Pikmin have opened my heart to the beauty of this world. I even started thinking there were some parts I do not need. A daydream. Told you! Yeah, okay, lost one in battle. I mean, it's his fault! He saw the fire, why did he think, oh, I'm tough, I could do this. Anyway... So far, so good. Still 16 parts remaining to collect. We've got 18 days remaining to do it. We're going to bring back, like, two, maybe three in the next video, because I'm going to try to get that bridge, those ramps built towards that where that spring was with the bomb rocks. So anyway, if you want to come back and see that happen in action, first of all, thank you for watching today's action. Feel free to let me know that you enjoyed it by clicking the old button, like button down below. And again, you know, I don't want to feel like I'm fishing for likes. If you didn't like it, you're welcome to push that dislike button which doesn't show on videos anymore which is weird but if you do tell me what didn't I do right what could have won you over because I want to know how to improve these for the future if people aren't liking them 
But in the meantime, if you want to subscribe, because you did like today and you want to see some more stuff, click subscribe, hit the bell button to get notifications when new videos are coming up, and you can also click the join button below for the extra little bit of support and sponsorship to join as a channel member and start earning use of some perks today. That is that for today. Thank you folks for watching once again. Professor Chaz is signing off, and I'll catch you next time. Yeah.